Well, the Indian automotive industry is excited. It sold a record number of cars and SUVs in the month of September. And companies hope that this momentum will continue through the traditionally high sales festive season. CNBC TV 18's Danish Anand reports that many are planning both new launches and facelifts to existing models to give customers something to look forward to. Take a look. Facelifts to the Tata Nexon Ice and EV variants, special variants of the Kia Cadence X-Line and Seltos, souped-up versions of the Honda Elevate and the Hyundai Exter, and all new vehicles like the Mercedes GLC and EQE 500 4MATIC SUV, the BMW iX1, the Audi Q8 e-tron, the Triumph 1200, the TVS X and the TVS RTR 310. India's auto sector has been buzzing with activity to show up product pipelines over the last two months as it prepared for the four-month-long festive season which started in September. The results in September have been solid with average sales growth at 10% and the sector is enthused. As a dealer community, as dealers, we are pretty optimistic about the upcoming festival season. And uh, we uh, we already saw uh, in September passenger vehicle creating an all-time high for the individual month of September. So every month, a kind of a new record is being created for the auto retails. And uh, uh, we have also seen uh, consumers coming out uh, during festival seasons with all their savings and, uh, you know, really uh, encashing on their murats and auspicious days to buy vehicles. So overall, we are expecting a very, uh, and overall, 95% uh, of the monsoon has covered well, well across India and uh, with a decent crop also, uh, everything good, uh, seems good for the upcoming festival season for auto industry. As Diwali approaches, more facelifts are on the anvil. Tata Motors is expected to launch a facelifted version of its popular SUVs, Safari and Harrier. Maruti Suzuki, meanwhile, is confident it will sell 5 lakh units during the festive season. And Hyundai Motor India is fairly certain of record sales. The demand is very robust and uh, if you see Onam, we had a growth of about 9 to 10 percent in sales. Even in Ganesh, we had an uh, increase of about 9 to 10 percent. We feel that the, the momentum is robust and this festival is very different from last two years because the stock levels are very optimum, 20 to 25 days of stock. We are in a position to really give more and more deliveries to more and more customers. We feel this number of 9 percent we can expect going forward in the festival season as well. If you see January to September, Hyundai has grown by 9%. We feel October to December also, some, somewhere around 85 9% is a reasonable growth to expect. And we should end this year with the 85 to 9% growth over last year, which was the highest year ever year for us. This also means one can expect offers and discounts to new customers. Auto dealers say that on an average, cars are being sold at an 8% discount. Luxury car maker BMW has launched schemes offering better EMIs at lower interest rates and Mercedes-Benz is offering complementary insurance with better financing options. They say as the season progresses, more such offers will hit the showrooms. In New Delhi, with Bureau journalist Rajendra Singh, this is Dana Shannon for CNBC TV 18.